Alright, this is Nifty and 15 minute chart. As we discussed yesterday, uh, price are creating all time high. So, if you not see in a daily time frame, and we are not interested to take any position for the long term. So, we are expecting that price may give a correction. But as an intraday trader, uh, let's see somewhere here. Uh, we have seen one confirmation uh, somewhere here. So in this area, first confirmation according to a uh, candlestick pattern, uh, they are forming a bullish candlestick pattern and the second confirmation moving average 7 cross 20 and the third uh, somewhere there RSI you can see here first RSI are bouncing off 40 and RSI cross 60 and they are bouncing off 100 CCI. So many confirmation are forming in a small time frame like uh, 15 minute. Uh, we place buy order a little more above this resistance line. And all the way here, you can see price uh, break this resistance line and all the way price goes up and create an all time high. And if you now see like uh, a bank nifty, let me show you bank nifty also. Okay. Uh, this one bank nifty, uh, there are no trade opportunity. And if you now see uh, daily time frame, as I said yesterday, this uh, bearish candlestick pattern, uh, this one, all right. It is not valid. Why? Because this candle, various candlestick pattern, just uh, forming above this resistance line. So that is why we are not looking for short. I think you remember, as I said yesterday. So if you are not seen a small time frame, where is the uh, buy confirmation? Let's just see. In a small time frame, price go uh, up and somewhere there grows up. Uh, sorry, goes up and the pullback goes up pull back and it act as a support right this one 50 exponential moving average uh, i can say ema 50 ema this one uh, why is it important because if you not see the previous market behavior price are bouncing off 50 exponential moving average have you seen i think you remember when uh, price um, respecting specific moving average, uh, moving average in past, so we are looking for enter exactly in that moving average after getting a confirmation. So let's see what is the confirmation. So later here we can see uh, moving average seven cross twenty. That is a confirmation, but it's a uh, still not able to break this level and another here you can see just trying to cross this level basically we need two to three confirmation but we miss that opportunity all right okay let's see today top gainer stock uh, first one is dfc life is dfc life uh, this is the perfect entry point uh, that was yesterday because uh, when they are forming uh, this type of uh, entry point uh, uh, before closing the market, we uh, place the order and hold it for, for the next day. All right. So why? Now you can see CC across 60. Uh, sorry, RSI CC, uh, CC across 100, and the moving average also cross somewhere there. So perfect entry point, and we enter here, and we hold our position. So we just converting. Uh, to, uh, to a swing trader, all right. So, next, uh, you can see this one CIPLA, uh, CIPLA somewhere there, anti point. Mm. It was exactly uh, that was a support if you not see in a large time frame like a daily time, uh, daily chart. Just a minute, yeah daily chart uh, price broke this area clear uptrend and act as a support and pullback all right so if you now see in a small time frame like here 
uh, this one uh, pull back act as a support so price just open here but that is our not entry point so later somewhere there above here but uh, we just waiting for a pullback so later here you can see this is the perfect entry point somewhere there but actually we missed that opportunity next the tcs and uh, we had a trade here and a perfect crossover uh, crossover and entry point somewhere there so all the way price goes up from this area and if you now see price are just bouncing off specific moving average all right so they are bouncing but we we are not able to catch the market somewhere there and we catch the market here because we need more confirmation so means we just are looking for high probability nestle uh, yesterday we have seen some opportunity but today we missed here all right no trade opportunity because price was just running in a sideway according to this rsi and the price here somewhere there and the point was but we we was expecting the price will give a correction from this area but we missed that opportunity dr reddy so let's see the reddy and here i can see why we didn't enter here are uh, after getting a confirmation we missed that opportunity because price just below this uh, supporting line uh, sorry resistance line here if you now see in a daily time frame this 200 moving average exactly for my resistance so if in a small time frame we have seen some confirmation but we we miss that opportunity or actually we avoid this type of trade all right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe and thanks for watching